So I realized, okay, I've committed my life to the Lord. So it was just a natural uh, follow-up to that. So I commit my music to the Lord. Mm -hmm. If I ever get to sing, if I ever get to write a song, if I ever get to do anything musically, it will be only for the Lord. Mm -hmm. Now, in 1965, to say that, there was no context of understanding. There was no such thing as contemporary Christian music. It would be 1974, approximately, before that term even arrived. Late 60s, early 70s, as people were getting saved, especially in the hippie movement, you know, uh, called it Jesus music, Jesus rock, whatever. We didn't know what to call it. We just did it. So that was just kind of beginning. Uh, 